Ready? One, two, three. Ah! Today is yet another vlog, but today is a little bit of a different one because it's a retro themed one. I don't know why, but I really like, like I really enjoy the nostalgic feeling of like camcorder videos and stuff like that. So I tried to kind of um, make that type of video and yeah, I wanted to thank you guys for the support. I see all your guys' comments and I'm just so glad that like people are liking my videos and yeah. I don't know, I feel, it feels really special, so thank you for watching, and let's get into the video. So, 
Oh my god. No, I think I'm crying. <laughs> I was so, so excited to show you guys this haul because it's so cute. All the things that I got was just adorable. Okay. Ah, these are so cute. Okay, so I got two, um, me and my friend got photo card holders so that we can use them for kind of like cafes and stuff like that. Like when we go to cafes, you can take cute pictures in them. So we got like matching ones. I got the pink one and she got the white one. So it's like like matching like this so it's super cute oh my god i'm so excited and the person that we ordered off of uh they gave us these two like uh keychain things so i'm so excited but and in the back there are chikawa stickers so i'm really excited <laughs> to use those and then here ah this is this is such a cute miku stand so this is made miku and this is also made Miku. I already have the acrylic stand of the figure of this and I really wanted a matching acrylic stand. So I'm so excited that this one came. She's wearing the same outfit and she has the exact same hairstyle as well. Um, the only thing is I thought it was going to be bigger. This is the next item but most of my items are like this big but um, Miku's is like quite small so I was kind of surprised about that but that's honestly kind of on me because I never really like look at the description I just kind of only see the picture when I buy things but I'm gonna try not to do that now but it's still really cute and I'm just really happy that it matches like the Miku that I already have and dun -dun -dun. this one <laughs> this is so cute so this is Marin um, if you guys know my dress up darling, she's so precious. I've never really, I've never really seen a lot of acrylic stands for Marin like just day to day when I'm shopping. I, I don't know really how popular she is because to like, to girls that really like, like J fashion and stuff like that, she is a very popular character. But I feel like in Japan as a whole, she's not as popular, definitely not like, you know demon slayer or like quintessential quintuplets level but um even a show like Riko Riko actually has actually a super popular here which is um which is like a totally different genre and stuff like that too but it's just like i don't know it's just so different and you can definitely see like which animes are popular based on like how much of the merch and stuff they have but there is like an animate section for Marin all the time, but well for Dress Up Darling, but I don't see like it's not too too big and I don't see like a bunch of goods for her, but she is so precious and so cute. The next one I have is actually this one! This is Kana. So this is from Oshinoko. Uh, if you guys saw my last video, I went to the Oshinoko cafe, but actually this figure was sold out like this acrylic stand was sold out and i really wanted to get it because i really like made themed acrylic stands so i just knew i had to get it online and then the last and perhaps most exciting one is <laughs> this is so cute oh my god i'm so excited i'm so happy just look at how big he is i didn't think that he was gonna be this big but this is like super big oh Oh my god, this is so he was he was around $50 and I'm not gonna lie, it is quite expensive. Actually, um one of my friends, Kat, she was like, wow, is this the price that we have to pay for dolls these days? But the thing is, first of all, it's it's completely new. And second of all, Secondly, secondly, <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Oh, and it's really big too. It's like, I'm gonna cry. Oh my god. <laughs> I just really love, I love crepes as well. So to have this, first of all, be so big. 
and to have this as a crepe it's just perfect oh my god it's so oh my god welling up with tears right now because first of all i'm gonna give you like the whole rundown the quality is amazing it's so like like soft to touch and like it's clearly made of of like a really good quality fabric and stuff um as expected because it's like official chikawa merch but uh First of all, it's in the shape of a crepe, which is one of my favorite desserts. Secondly, it has whipping cream on top, also something that I like on desserts. And this little mush 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 and kino cherries. And then it's so it's so soft. Oh my god, I just hit myself. It's so soft huge like this is so big too <laughs> oh my god it's so cute <sighs> it's just so perfect oh my god i don't i don't think i don't think i don't i have no words i don't think this could be any better than it is this is this is so adorable and i'm treasuring this with my life this is so cute I'm gonna set up all the acrylic stands and show them to you. We have the Kana stand, so cute. She looks like this. Marin stand, looks like this. We have the Miku stand. This looks so cute, oh my god. Okay, now with that out of the way, I am so hungry. I didn't eat yet, so I changed into my PJs and now I'm going to eat some food. I know this doesn't look appetizing, but I I love um, chili. Chili is just, oh, I love chili. I love chili and then this is tamago sando, which I also really like, but this chili, oh my god.
に映画行かない<笑>行きます So this is also like a magnet, so you can put it on your fridge and stuff, and it's so cute! Oh my god! <laughs> so I got this one at the Kombini. It has the almond chocolate in it. But see, this is what I meant. Like, Likoriko is really popular here. And I feel like it's much more popular here than it is like in the US. So um, thankfully, I really like um, Takina. So I end up seeing a lot of her merch, which is nice. I just am not the hugest fan of like their original outfits that they have, but this looks really good. <laughs> then we have. Oh, these are so cute. They're like little hearts. So this is one of the ones that my friend got me. Uh, Mia didn't really say where it was from, but she knew that I would really like it because obviously it's Mikagurashi. <laughs> Oh, I thought they would be green, but they're actually yellow. <laughs> they're so cute. Mm. And they do taste like grapes. Mm. Mm. My favorite are the I really like the jelly taste.
Ignore that part. for watching my hair it looks crazy oh my goodness because i did braids like yesterday but yeah thank you so much for watching and let me know if you like these types of vlogs i personally really enjoy watching um like these types of i don't even know what to call it like a little bit retro aesthetic vlogs so let me know if you enjoy them too and i will continue making them if people like them so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I I still can't, I'm still getting used to kind of talking uh, to the camera because uh, even in real life, I can't, I'm not really that good at making eye contact, which is something that I'm working on. But yeah, thank you so much for watching as always. And I will see you hopefully in the next one. Goodbye. Bye.